This video tutorial will show you how to use the morphological adaptations test in the vegetation module of the wetland determination data forms in Core JD. As you can see, we are already in the vegetation module here. We have some data entered. Now, the morphological adaptation test has to be performed from the hydrophytic vegetation indicator box itself. So as you can see here, I have morphological adaptations. I'll go ahead and click on perform test. So now, as you can see, I get a new window here with a few different options. So first, what is the morphological adaptation that was observed? Adventitious roots, shallow root systems, or other? So I'll go ahead and click on other. So now that we have the condition established, we have to establish which plant to apply this to. So as you can see here, in the arid west, only FACU plants can be used for morphological adaptations. So we have a list of the FACU plants we've entered which is only one here, so I'll go ahead and select that. And now the rule for this is that the percentage has to be greater than 50% for it to pass. So we'll see here, I'll initially put in a 40% percentage, enter in my remark, and then I'll click on OK. So now as you can see here, we're getting an error message that's saying, enter a percentage greater than 50 for this plant, because by definition, if more than 50% of the individuals of, of a FACU species have morphological adaptations for life in wetlands, then that species is considered to be a hydrophyte and as an, in, and as an indicator on that plot should be reassigned as FAC. So as you can see here, I'll go ahead and change my percentage, let's say to 55, and so now by doing this and selecting OK, this plant's indicator will change from FACU to FAC. I'll scroll up and see that currently the indicator is a FACU for this plant. So now you can see my data form is refreshed, my FACU plant is now a FAC plant, and my dominance test has been recalculated using this new data. So that wraps up how to use morphological adaptations. The main things to note in the vegetation module for this test is that you must have a FACU plant in order to begin this test. And additionally, your dominance and prevalence, if required, will be recalculated given this new data. So that wraps up how to use morphological adaptations in the vegetation module of the wetland determination data forms in Core JD.